Hello, my name is Jarosław Rodzeń. I'm a cosmetologist and a trainer for Bandi. Today I will demonstrate a chemical exfoliation treatment with peruvic, azelaic and salicylic acid, an exfoliation Bandi product. The treatment is primarily directed at skins with hyperactivity of sebaceous glands and excess sebum secretion. It is recommended for all skin types depending on the problem. But the main recommendations are for seborrheic, acne skin and with expanded pores. The treatment also deals with retentional acne, with open and closed comedones, as well as with acne rosacea. The age of the patient is not the most important issue, although we perform treatments from 16 years of age with parents' consent. Later, only contraindications are the limits for the treatment. Another unique feature of this combination of the three acids is the possibility to use them on sensitive and capillary skin. Due to its high affinity with lipid structures, the peruvic acid does not damage nor irritate capillaries, does not affect their size and doesn't make them more visible. Bandi's exfoliation mixture is also recommended for mature skins, as each of the acids used in the formula has a different scope of activity. Peruvic acid has excellent dermoplastic properties and acts by remodeling the collagen fibers and through increased synthesis of hyaluronic acid in fibroblasts. Dendritic activity of pyruvic acid stimulates the fibroblasts, but also works inflammation-wise. Interleukins are produced on catabolic and anabolic routes. Those inflammatory mediators are to stimulate the fibroblast to increase the production of collagen and elastin. Pyruvic acid is one of the few in cosmetology to have affinity to lipid structures and penetrated the epidermis well due to its small particle size. The mixture we have used has been enveloped in isoparaffin solution, a hydrocarbon compound responsible for the gradual freeing of protons into the skin. The acid is in consequence gentle, not aggressive and does not cause arrhythmia on the skin. The addition of salicylic acid as anti-inflammatory acid and having keratolytic effect is of particular importance for oil skin with excess sebum. As a laic acid makes the mixture not only anti-inflammatory but also allows it to tackle discolorations. The acid has very strong properties of inhibiting tyrannosase and so inhibits the production of melanin. The mixture of those acids is aimed at improving the skin by eliminating its imperfections on different levels. Not only the repair of acne skin, the reduction of inflammations, discolorations or wrinkles, but also the care and the prevention of the formation of post-inflammatory discolorations. It is the azelaic acid that inhibits tyrannosase and stops the production of melanin in inflammations. The excellent mixture of peruvic, azelaic and salicylic acids is therefore perfect for all types of skin, especially seborrheic skin. The serum is designed particularly for skins with sebaceous gland problems, oily, combination and mature skins. Enjoy the treatment procedure video. We begin with cleansing the skin from all impurities like oil and makeup. I start the cleansing from the eye area. 
I apply the eye and makeup remover, the cleansing gel on cotton pads, put them on the eyes and massage gently. The gel will be dissolving the mascara for about two minutes. We can then gently remove the pads, cleansing the lids starting from the inner corner towards the outer corner. Next, cleanse the lashes with vertical movements. Removing color cosmetics is essential. Always remember to move towards the circular muscle, towards the outside on the upper lid and towards the inside on the lower lid. We can now move on to cleanse the face. As I will be using a gel, I soak cotton pads with water and gently wipe the skin, leaving water particles on its surface. I can now apply the remover gel. I cleanse the whole area with gentle circular movements. In the case of heavy waterproof or fixed makeup, first apply a lotion, as fat dissolves fat. Therefore, the first step in cleansing would be removing the makeup with a lotion and only then removing the oil. Emulgate the gel with water for it to bind well with the impurities, then rinse with water. It is recommended to start preparing the skin two weeks before the treatment using creams containing the acids to be applied in the salon. I recommend the client starts using a low concentration cream like Bandy's 5% Peruvic, Azelaic and Salicylic Acid Cream as preparation but also continuation of the treatment at home and for the night. Jako proces przygotowania skóry do zabiegu i potem kontynuacji e, zabiegowej tym kremem w pielęgnacji domowej na noc. Dokładnie oczyszczamy. Cleanse the whole surface carefully. The next step is to prepare the skin for the chemical treatment. Apply an acid activator, which will ensure better acid penetration and prepare the skin. The main activity of the activator is lowering the skin's pH and removing the fat. Thanks to the low concentration of fruit acids contained, it also removes the hydrolipid barrier of the skin. The cleansing is thorough. I am not just wiping the face, I am spreading the formula intensively for the skin to be thoroughly cleansed. Only now can I locally secure the face against acid activity with Vaseline or a greasy cream, especially the lips, the mucous membranes of the nose. Śluzową nosa. 
I also look for any lesions of illness which protrude from the skin, like papilla or moles, but also uneven and asymmetric birthmarks or other suspicious places. We should secure them all, most commonly with Vaseline or a cream. I can now apply the acid. There are two ways to do it. One is to secure the eyes with cotton pads with a relaxing fluid by applying them on the eyelids. We can now prepare We can now prepare the exfoliating mixture. Add two pumps of peruvic, azelaic and salicylic acid into the bowl and apply it on the face with a brush. When treating the whole area of the face, neck and décolletage, start by applying a thin layer of acid on the face from the chin towards the jaw and the temple. Avoid the sensitive parts of the cheeks. Now from the forehead down the nose. Apply the exfoliator near the lower eyelid. By pressing the edge of the brush, create a fold to mark the borderline for the acid. See how by pressing the brush a fold appears near the lower eyelid, which is safe when applying the acid due to its gel formula that will not migrate into the eye. In a series of treatments, it is recommended to start exposing the skin to acid activity starting with one to two minutes and extending this time up to ten minutes. After the face, we apply the formula on the décolletage. It is important that it be applied on the neck in the last stage as the skin of the neck is very sensitive. At what intervals should the pyruvic, azelaic and salicylic acid be used? In anti-acne therapy, the intervals should be of 7 to 10 days in a 6 treatment series. And in dermoplastic and anti-aging therapy, for non-problematic skin, use it every 21 days. Now leave the patient for maximum 10 minutes and in the first exfoliation lower this time to 3 to 5 minutes. Always remember to monitor the skin during chemical exfoliation. Gentle reddening is a good time to rinse the acid. It is a signal that the acids penetrate deep into the epidermis and we should start neutralizing and cleansing the acid. Here we can wait a few more moments. But when the patient feels stinging on the skin, we can massage the skin with a brush, making it more comfortable for the patient. It is good to remove pyruvic acid first with water and then with a neutralizer, because thermic reactions do occur during this procedure. If we put water directly on the acid, pyruvic acid changes into lactic acid and the thermic effect is decreased. Applying the neutralizer directly on the acid 
there will be a strong reddening and a thermic reaction. Za pomocą wody zmywam sobie już produkt eksfoliujący. Dokładnie zmywam produkt. Thoroughly remove the exfoliating formula with water. And then apply the neutralizer. Wipe the skin until the feeling of stinging or discomfort stops. Now dry the skin. It's time to move on to soothing the skin. I will now apply the prebiotic serum containing pre and probiotics, symbiotics, gallic acid esters combined with catecholamines. The combination of these active ingredients aims at the fast regeneration of the skin and preventing inflammations. I add two pumps of the formula into the bowl and applying the skin with a brush. I do this to stimulate the natural protective processes of the skin. The serum contains probiotics and the yakon extract which strengthens the skin's immune system. We apply the serum. Serum bogate w probiotyki. Massage evenly on the skin. It brings great relief after the exfoliation. And now apply the mask. Apply a thin layer of the smoothing mask or the AHA line to smooth the skin.
You may also massage the mask into the skin. We can now enrich this treatment with algae with chlorophyll by applying them on the thin mask we have just spread on the skin. Natural algae add to the soothing and moisturizing effect. Remember to secure the hairline. Now apply the micro-ionized rubber mask. I add about 30 milliliters of the powder to the bowl. And mix it with pure water. It can be still mineral water, distilled water, but it shouldn't be tap water. You should get about 100 milliliters of the mixture by adding about 70 milliliters of water. Notice that although the mask is lipophilic, so containing fat particles, our micro-ionized natural algae will have excellent skin adhesion and won't slide down the face or detach from it. Start applying the algae. It is very plastic, spreads and dries really well and doesn't slide too fast. Algae with chlorophyll may also be applied on the eyes and the lips because the formula doesn't contain preservatives, dyes or fragrances. Applying the algae on the mask gives the skin a really soothing effect. Apply on the eyes. Always start from the upper lid so the formula doesn't get into the eye. Algae also have a wonderful effect on the lips, so we can freely cover them as well. Tak, algę pozostawiamy na około 20 minut do czasu zastygnięcia. And so we leave the formula for about 20 minutes until it dries. 
Bierzemy całymi dłońmi na skórze i delikatnie jakbyśmy chcieli poruszać. Hold the face with the whole palms and as if wanting to move the whole surface of the face, detach the algae from the skin. Next, use moistened fingers to detach the algae edges and gradually pull it off. Pozostałości po algach domywamy sobie tonikiem. Remove the residue with a tonic. At the same time, you tone the skin, preparing it for the final cream. Now the skin is ready for the application of the cream. We start with the area under the eyes, starting with crow's feet, and moving along the lower lid and partly around the brow. Always remember to start with the outer corner of the eye moving towards the inside at the bottom and opposite at the top. You may also gently massage the skin with eight-shaped movements. I will finally apply the probiotic protective face cream with filter 25, a photostable filter which protects the skin against UV radiation. It is a novel molecular filter based on titanium oxide and remains on the skin for up to six hours. The white residue you can see is common when using oxides but will soon absorb. You may also see it as information where the cream has been applied. After spreading the cream, gently massage it in. When it partly absorbs, start pressing it in gently. Do this for even application. This procedure ends the treatment. The client may now use mineral powders for improving or adding skin tone before leaving the salon. This is the end of the treatment.